after watching this video so far, I'd like to say, put a message forward. What we're learning here is that really the people who are at the front line of HDR are people like you, the colorists. But you've got a lot of people standing behind you and you actually have to help them understand what's going on going forward. So communicating with the cameraman more, a bit more on set to start off with, a lot of learning processes here. My coverage this year is mainly to start the learning processes and flag the fact that we have all got to jump into another learning processes as we did with going from standard def to high definition television HD the fact that we had to change the way we made sets now we have to change the way we have to light for high dynamic range we have to start working together collaboratively and sharing all these ideas and these feedbacks up and down the line and you have to be prepared to do that until the language is learnt again yeah, one good thing is that because we work so closely with the director of photography, um, I will work for the next project, uh, Independence Day Resurgence, with uh, Marcus Föderer, it's a German DP. He really started to embrace the idea of HDR. So what we are doing is we will do a pass at Dolby for the project, and he's learning from there how to go back in the set and take advantage of it. Yes. So we, we both together learn at this point from the back end, how to redo the next movie better from the front end. That's right, yeah. They will take a few iterations. That's right, yes. And yeah. everybody's experimenting a little bit. Um, he did the remaster of the original Independence Day at Modern, and uh, he, he told me it was really liking for him to play with HDR, to see what you can, what your master can gain out of it, and then learning how to really the scene based on what you will do at the back end. It's, it gives you a sense of freedom um, of experiment in a way. That's right, yeah. I mean, it's, it's, I don't know how to tell a new DP, do HDR yeah, if yeah, yeah. you never saw the that's actual product. That's it's, right, it's, yeah. it's very difficult. It's, that's it's, right. It's like trying to see a blind man what the sunset looks like. You, you need to see it. It needs you to be something. You need to see it once yeah, and then, right. oh my God, yes. that's, that's a You have an understanding. Yeah, that's right. Um, now let's get on to... I was actually, if I can, yeah. I was watching the, the demo at Christie of the HDR projector with some, even normal material show yeah in an HDR uh, kind of a presentation, it gives you a new dimension and a, a new way to, to present your content. It's, yes. It, at the moment, often is an afterthought, but I can totally see becoming a, just a product in itself, not just an afterthought.